Hi, I want to talk a little bit about legislative deadlines and exemptions. You know, in the California legislature, in its joint rules, there's a listing of deadlines for both the first and second years of its two-year legislative session. And these deadlines are contained in Joint Rule 61. Joint Rule 61 specifies that the deadline set forth in this rule shall be observed by the Senate and Assembly. After each deadline, the Secretary of the Senate and the Chief Clerk of the Assembly may not accept committee reports from their respective committees except as otherwise provided in this rule. So Joint Rule 61A provides the deadlines for the odd numbered or the first year of the legislative session while Joint Rule 61B sets forth the deadlines for the even numbered or the second year of the session. Now, after that, Joint Rule 61 establishes a number of exceptions. So what are they? The deadlines do not apply to the rules committees of the Senate and Assembly. The deadlines do not apply where a bill is referred to committee under Joint Rule 26.5. The deadline, uh, deadlines in 61 don't apply to a committee that has received a bill due to substantial amendments under Assembly Rule 77.2 or Senate Rule 29.10. Also, other either House may meet for the purpose of considering a constitutional amendment or a bill that would go into immediate effect pursuant to the Constitution at any time during the session. Also note that joint and concurrent resolutions are exempt from the deadlines under Joint Rule 61. And finally, subdivision I of Joint Rule 61 can be suspended uh, as to any particular bill with approval from the Committee on Rules and then a two thirds vote of the membership of the particular house in which it is being considered. So. Despite several exemptions from the Joint Rule 61 deadlines, there's also a two-thirds uh, vote to waive Joint Rule 61 if so desired.